out how much carpet you need, you simply will call R1, R2, H1, uh, we'll call this lounge, dining and B3. Write your measurements down, 5.2 by 3.6. It doesn't matter what the room looks like as long as the measurements are accurate. To simply work it out, say goodbye. I'm going to put the calculator. Help. Often you'll see carpet looks cheap. But 22, 24, 26, 30 odd bucks a metre. There's two types of metres with carpet. One is the original what they call broad loom, which was 12 foot by a yard before metric come in, or 3.66 by a metre, or square metres. What looks cheap often is a square metre. A square metre is 3.66 times a square metre. So if you're going to work the carpet out, you multiply your length by width. So that is 19 0.03 square metres, not lineal square. 157.03 square metres of carpet needed for this particular example. We want to work out how much lineal metre or old school broadloom metre of carpet is in this. We multiply the length by the width equals square. Square metre divided by 3.66 gives us our lineal or broad loom, which is how carpet is made and how it is generally charged for. If you were to go into a shop and see carpet at $20 a, a metre, and without knowing the difference, you would be multiplying 157 by 20 equals, you'd be looking at $3,000 at square meterage. We've got 157.03 square metres. We're dividing that by 3.66 equals 42.9 lineal or BL for broad loom. This is a broad loom width. 3.66 or in the old books called this is a lineal metre. That, that width by one metre is a lineal metre. So like, you're talking, you're getting pretty good value. A square metre obviously is a square metre. But this is how carpet is made, by a broad loom. Do not walk into a carpet shop telling them how much carpet you need. On several areas in the house where a new broad loom roll or lineal roll has to be cut into, uh, some companies actually charge you, and rightly so, because they have to buy the carpet, buy the broad loom from the mills. So don't go in there with what everything I've said here is gospel, but just use that as a ballpark to keep the carpet companies on their toes as well. You know, I like a little bit of both ways here. There's nothing wrong with a bit of prior preparation prevents bit performance. You go draw your floor plan rough as, as long as your measurements are accurate. Don't hinder that. Length by width equals square. Divide the square by 3.66 equals your lineal or broad loom metres required. Mm -hmm.